Uh, first up, uh, you know, Millet uh, has uh, some good news. Uh, Millet has come out, um, I, I think, uh, the last couple of days. He, he gave a, a speech, and in the speech is the first time, I think really since he got elected, where he articulated a plan for dollarizing the Argentinian economy. He actually recommitted to it, said it's going to happen, explained what needs to happen for it to happen, and, and how he perceives it, how he sees kind of the, the process happening. Uh, it, it, it seems quite reasonable, uh, you know, kind of get rid of liabilities on the, um, on the um, uh, central bank's uh, site, uh, you know, stabilize the peso, then drive, uh, drive money expansion, that is new pesos being entered into the economy to zero, then make the dollar legal tender, uh, as well as the peso, let them compete, uh, and the peso will slowly disappear, uh, and the dollar will come to dominate. So, so that is what he is proposing. Of course, to do that, at some point, they would have to get rid of all the capital controls they have. Capital controls are, are controls on exchanging money. Uh, we don't have capital controls in the United States, thankfully, although who knows <laughs> what's, uh, what's in the future for us, because... Uh, given some of the nutty uh, proposals about trade coming out of um, potential Trump appointees, capital controls might be necessary in order for them to achieve their goals. But but we'll see. So far, no capital controls in the United States. Uh, uh, but uh, there's a plan. And uh, many, uh, I, including myself, were a little worried about uh, that he was going to abandon uh, dollarization. His Treasury Secretary, the appointed, was not... Uh, was not a dollarization guy, uh, but he he is recommitted to it. So uh, exactly when, nobody knows. It depends on the market, they tell us, uh, and uh, how, how quickly they can, they can, you know, how quickly they can kind of unwind the balance sheet of the central bank. Uh, but it's exciting to see it's still an agenda, and I don't know. I don't know enough about Argentinian law about whether he can do it, right, whether he can do it uh, unilaterally or whether he needs uh, the help of, um, of, the, uh, of parliament in order to achieve it. If he needs the help of parliament in order to achieve it, and sadly, unfortunately, it probably will not happen. But uh, it's good to know Millet has not given up on his... Uh, expectations uh, in terms of um, in terms of dollarization